No. No! You don't think it's a bear, do you? I'm not fine! Hi buddies, you guys are watching Quiet Unicorn. If you're new to my channel, my name's Holly. So right now, I'm staying at my parents' house in Canada and I wanted to show you all where I grew up. So when I was about eight years old, my dad built a tree house for me and my brother to play in in the backyard. And it's just through here. There it is. I'm gonna go around this way. Timo, what are you doing up there? I demand a rematch. Alrighty, so a little while ago, Timo and I did a last to leave the tent challenge and unfortunately for Timo, I won that one. But there were extenuating circumstances. Anyway, it was a really fun challenge and even though I did win, I think we both tried really hard and Timo was a very good challenger. And now it's time for a rematch. All right, if you think that I'm gonna win this challenge, leave a unicorn emoji in the comment section. And if you think I'm gonna win, leave a trophy emoji in the comment section. Wait a second. Last time, we did a last to leave the tent challenge because there wasn't enough beds for us to sleep in. So, what kind of challenge are we doing this time? Well, that's why I'm here. I challenge you to a last to leave the treehouse challenge. All right, you're on. I think it's time to get ready get our supplies. All right, but I think that this time we should make an extra rule to make this more challenging. So this time we're only going to be allowed to bring in five different supplies. Five, no problem. Okay, meet back here in two hours to start the challenge. All right, Timo, are you ready to start this challenge? Oh, I'm ready. Okay, I've got all my supplies in this bag. Have you got all the supplies you need? Yep, I've got my five items right here. Do you want to like go to the bathroom before we get started? Oh, good idea. I don't think there's a toilet on that treehouse. Okay, now that Timo's gone, I can set up my secret plan. So the rule is that we're only allowed to bring five different items inside of the treehouse, but we didn't say anything about hiding items outside of the treehouse. So I don't know how long this competition's gonna go on for, and I don't wanna run out of food. So here's what I've decided to do. So I've got this bucket full of snacks. These are actually the snacks that Timo tried to use to tempt me out of the tent in the last leave the tent challenge. Didn't work, um, but I am going to eat them this time. So I've tied a rope to the end of this bucket, and I'm gonna swing it out the window of the treehouse. And then if I run out of food, I can just pull up the rope like a little pulley system and pull up my bucket full of treats, and then I'll be able to last for eight. So I'll put my bucket here where Timo won't notice it and then I'm gonna run this string all the way up to the window. I think I'm gonna win this challenge for sure. Hey, you probably want to use the bathroom too, yeah? Oh yeah, good idea. Okay, now that Holly's gone, I can set up my secret plan. Five items isn't a lot of things to bring into the treehouse and I don't really want to run out of food. So what I'm thinking is I'm gonna tie this tasty cliff bar to my drone here and then when I get super hungry, I can just use my phone and fly the drone into the treehouse with this cliff bar and feed myself with it. Should probably test it out and make sure it works first. Okay, here we go. Let's see if this works. There goes the cliff bar. It's working. This little drone here is definitely gonna help me win this last to leave challenge. All right, Timo, now are we ready to start the competition? Yeah, I'm ready. Are you ready? All right, let's go into the tree house. Oh. I almost forgot my fifth item. Okay. It's actually pretty cold in here. Mmm, cozy. I can't believe I forgot to bring a sleeping bag. Tactical error, Timo. I think it's gonna be a long, cold night for you. Timo, what did you decide to bring? Should we show each other our supplies? Yeah, for sure. So I obviously brought my sleeping bag because I don't know how long this challenge is gonna go on for and I don't wanna be stuck without a sleeping bag at night. And then in my supply bag here, I also brought an extra sweater, some food. So this is a pad tie that looks Super delicious, really excited to try that. Um, and then for entertainment, I brought a Harry Potter book. And because it's probably gonna get pretty dark in here, I brought a torch. Whoa, really? That's what you decided to bring? Well, I think I made really good choices. What, what did you decide to bring? All right, so I brought randomly also the same pad thai packet of dried food as you. Um, this will be great for dinner. Um, I brought a thermos of hot water. Um, I brought a 
iPad for entertainment. And uh, I've got my drone controller. And uh, over here you'll see I have uh, my charging station for all my charging needs. Um, so basically I'll never be left without entertainment or flat batteries. Wait, why did you bring a thermos? Um, so I can make my pad thai. See here, it says add hot water. Oh no, I didn't bring any hot water. How am I supposed to make my pad thai? Well... Let me guess, you're gonna say I should just leave the treehouse and sacrifice the competition. No, no, um, how about we share the hot water? Uh, you know, it's plenty to go around. Wow, that's like super generous. Uh, just a second, I need to just check something inside my sleeping bag. I don't think that Timo can hear me in here. I'm a bit suspicious about what's going on here. Like, why would Timo offer to share his hot water with me? This is a competition. This is all part of my plan. I read an online review about this bad guy here, and they said that it causes unusual amounts of flatulence. If Ollie and I eat this bad guy, the treehouse might get so stinky that you'll probably have to leave the treehouse. Okay, I think I'm gonna take Timo up on his offer of the hot water and eat the pad thai. I did read online that apparently it causes unwanted gases, but luckily I brought a sweater to tie around my face just in case. Holly, um, you've been inside that sleeping bag for a long time. You, uh, okay in there? Fine, thanks. Um, should we eat dinner now? Um, cause I'm getting really hungry. Yeah, sounds good. I really wanna try this. All right, so it says remove and discard enclosed oxygen absorber. Alrighty. Guess that's. Mm, it smells nice. Guess that's this thing. Yeah, it says smooth peanut butter. <gasps> cool! And there's the peanut butter. Yum! This is gonna be so good! There it goes. A lot of peanut butter. Like we always carry a spoon with me wherever I go. Wow, it's hot. It's very hot. Seal it up. Gotta wait 20 minutes and then dinner is served. It's almost ready, just gotta add some of these peanuts for garnish. Do we want all the peanuts? Yeah, I love peanuts. All right, all the peanuts, in they go. Gotta add some spices. Sriracha seasoning. Let's see how spicy it is first. Mm. Oh, actually. <laughs> <coughs> That's really spicy. And then we give it our final stir. And we'll be ready to eat. Dinner's served! I mean, it doesn't look the greatest, but. Delicious. This smells so good. This is like the best camping food I've ever seen. Okay, let's try some. I love noodles. That's good. That's like a real meal. That was actually so good. I can't believe that's camping food. <laughs> Whoa, okay, why are you laughing like that? <laughs> <laughs> Seriously, that's really freaky. Why are you laughing like that? You've walked right into my trap, Holly. What do you mean? What trap? My delicious pad thai trap, of course. But how is that a trap? I'll think you'll find out before long. You will be the first to leave this tree house. But why would I leave the tree house? I've got a full belly, I'm having a really nice time. Everything's awesome. But Holly, you didn't read the product reviews, did you? This pad thai causes extreme gas. Now that we've eaten the pad thai, this treehouse is gonna get so stinky with farts that you won't have any choice but to leave. Holly, it might even attract bears. Oh, I read the review. That's why I brought this sweater to tie around my face. Wait, what? I read the review and I've got protection. Oh no, why didn't I think of protection? Heh 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 heh. It's okay, it's okay, it's okay. I'll be fine, there's plenty of fresh air in here. You're a ticking time bomb, Timo. I'll be fine, 
I'll be fine. I'll be fine. I might win this challenge after all. I'm not fine! All right, it's been a couple of hours. The fumes have pretty much cleared, but it's starting to get really dark. Timo, you feeling all right? He'll be fine. That pad time made me really thirsty. I'm gonna get some... Oh, no. Did I forget to bring water? And we used all the water to make that pad thai. Ah, good, you're still with us. All right, Timo, we gotta think about what we're gonna do. We are not gonna last long in here without hydration. There's gotta be some water in here somewhere. Oh, look, it's like some lemonade or something. Please don't drink that. Okay, uh, okay, maybe there's some, maybe there's some water somewhere around here. Maybe some of the rainwater could have gathered in the window ledge and we could, we could, we could suck it out of the window ledge. Yeah, I don't know about that. Your eyes are looking quite watery. What are you saying? I'm just pointing out that your eyes look like they're full of hydration. Why are you looking at me like that? Please let me drink the water from your eyeballs! Hey, stop that! Get away! Come on, I'm really thirsty! Just a little! No, it's weird! All right, fine. Guess we'll just be thirsty. Okay, it's getting really dark out now. Neither of us have left the treehouse, so I guess that means we're sleeping in here. Sleeping in here? I really didn't think we'd be in here overnight. Timo, that's totally fine. If you don't want to sleep in here, all you have to do is slide down the slide. Just slide on out of the treehouse and there's a nice, cozy, warm bed just waiting for you. Oh, that sounds really nice. That sounds really, really nice. Wait, you're trying to trick me. What? Me? Yeah, that's not going to happen. I can sleep in here. No problem. Yeah. It's real cozy. This'll do, this'll do fine. I'll sleep like a baby in here. Timo, what are you gonna do before bedtime? I think I'm just gonna watch some YouTube videos on my iPad till I fall asleep. But you've been watching YouTube videos like all day. Aren't you running out of battery? Well, almost. But you forgot, I brought chargers so I can charge my devices whenever I want. Oh yeah, I guess that was a good idea. No, no, come on, what's going on? No, no! It's not working! What's the matter? The power's gone off, it's not working! Really? This can't be happening! Please work! Please work! Timo, it's fine! You can manage without your iPad! Okay, I guess that means that you're kind of having a difficult time imagining going without your iPad for a while. Um, but probably it's a good thing to have a bit of a break from technology. Please don't say things like that in my time of need. Well, I'm gonna read my book. Yeah, you wanna read it out loud to me? I'm just happy reading by myself, thanks. But I'm so bored, Holly. Uh, what's happening now? What's happening now? What's happening now? Finally, I think he's asleep. I might go to bed too. Holly, wake up. What is it? I think I heard something out there. You don't think it's a bear, do you? It might be. I think it's in the tree. Oh no, it's on the roof. Maybe you should pop outside and check. I'm not leaving the treehouse. You can leave the treehouse. No way, I'm on a winning streak. I need to defend my title. Well, I'm not leaving the treehouse, okay? Okay, how about I just try to have a peek outside? I can use my flashlight. Okay. All right, I'm gonna have a look. can't see anything. You say it was on the roof? Dude, it's a squirrel. Oh, I knew that. Yeah, we really have to stop being so scared of squirrels. Okay, good night. Good morning! Good morning. How did you sleep? I actually slept so well. This sleeping bag is so cozy and it's so like puffy. It's actually perfect if you want to sleep sitting up. Like it is really comfortable and I got to hear the birds. It was just really nice. How about you? My back hurts. My shoulders hurt. And I don't think I can feel my butt anymore. Yeah, I can't believe that you didn't leave the treehouse. I guess it wasn't so bad. I'm really thirsty. I'm really hungry. Oh no. What are we going to do for breakfast? There must be something in here. Do you reckon we could eat this pine cone or this stick? Ooh. Ooh. No. We only had five items. Didn't have enough room for snacks. That's fine. Why don't you just pop up to the house and get some? 
Enough of your tricks. I have a plan. Oh, really? Well, I turned off my phone to preserve the last little bit of battery it had left in it in case I needed it to win this challenge. And it looks like I will. Ooh, sounds like fun. Let's see your secret plan. I'm bringing in extra supplies. Oh, no way. You've got a drone bringing in extra supplies? That's right. An extra cliff bar should be enough to get me through the day. Oh, no. Wait, I can't get it through the trees. Oh, no, I can't get it through the trees. All right, let me see if I can fly it around the other way. Oh no, there's branches there too. I can't make it. Oh no. I guess you'll just have to go retrieve it. Never, none of us have extra food supplies. So it's gonna be a waiting game. Well, as it turns out, Timo, I had a secret plan too. You have a drone too? You're never gonna make it. No, I decided to go a little bit lower tech. What's that? Extra supplies coming up. Oh no, why didn't I think of that? Mmm, these stacks will tie me over for ages. I will stay here all day. That licorice looks really good. Yup, pretty tasty. I'd love a snack. And Timo, I'll happily share them with you if you forfeit the challenge. <gasps> I've got so many snacks. I think I might be able to stay here for like another week. I can't take it anymore. So hungry. Oh my gosh, he left the treehouse. I win. It was worth it. Well, good game, Timo. You were a worthy competitor, but I'm afraid that I have won this round. Even though I didn't win, I still had fun. Maybe I'll win next time. If you liked watching this Last to Leave Challenge, make sure to like this video and let me know in the comment section what kind of Last to Leave Challenge you want to see next. And there's some more videos on the side here right now for you to watch. Bye, buddies.